ground, the dogs struggle to move the ball forward. Smart, kicks a goal. Here come the Crows. Jarman put the Crows in front with just under two minutes remaining. The Crows are in front. The Bulldogs had a chance to regain the lead but couldn't score. Adelaide hanging on to win by two points. But the sobering thought now is uh, in the cool light of the day, great win, fantastic win, but she's on again next week against the quality opposition of the competition this year. For St Kilda, next Saturday's grand final appearance will be the club's first in 26 years and the clock has to be turned back 31 years to find the Saints' one and only premiership. St Kilda won its grand final berth in front of more than 77,000 fans at the MCG last night, defeating North Melbourne by 31 points. Spearhead Jason Heatley was inspirational with seven goals. St Kilda dominated from the opening bounce. North Melbourne's hopes of back-to-back -back premierships took a dive 11 minutes into the term when star ruckman Corey McKernan left the ground with a dislocated shoulder. Jason Heatley was inspirational for the Saints, three late goals setting up a 15-point lead at quarter time. Goals to Lowe and Winmar extended the Saints' lead. But the Roos fought back late in the second term, reducing the deficit to 10 points at half-time. St Kilda took control of the match after the break. Heatley once again the spark. Heatley, yes, number one. North goalless in the third term, an ankle injury to John Longmire adding to their woes. The margin at three-quarter time, 38 points. The Kangaroos outscored the Saints in the final term, but it wasn't enough. St Kilda running out winners by 31 points.